I, I think a like a good point to be made about this. Um, cause I was just thinking like as a whole, we went from like Martha's vineyard to like Christ <laughs> on the cross. <laughs> um, and you know, like jumped around so many different aspects, but there is like, there's a concept that really needs to be understood. And I feel like more people should understand the idea of the idea of fractal patterns and that like, this is, these are not analogies that we're giving. Like, as Christ died on the cross, so too must we, uh, you know, offer ourselves up to our family. Like, th- that's not an analogy. It's, it's literally the same pattern that we participate in reality. And so Christ becoming embodied revealed these patterns of reality. And so we can see how they play out fractally from within the individual all the way up to, you know, the United Nations, um, that... They all are part of the same thing. And so when we're talking about like luxury beliefs and how we should treat the border and what we should do about that, it's the same concept of how I interact with my family, of having to deal with the embodied reality of individuals that might bother me and I have to reconcile with that. And that that is the same pattern. And so it's the idea of a fractal pattern that plays out from the individual all the way up. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. They're connected. Yeah. Um, and I mean, and that's what, that's Peterson's whole thing of like, clean your room is not like, oh, start with the small things. It's like, it's the gospel passage where Christ is like the person who is trustworthy in small things will be trustworthy in great ones. Mm-hmm. And it's not like an analogy. It's like, it all builds. Or it's not an arbitrary, uh, like just do this and have faith that you can move on to the next one. Yeah. It's like, actually these things are created, uh, connected in reality. Right. And so right. if you can do this naturally... Uh, yeah. It will follow that yeah. you can do this because when to, you clean your room, yeah. you are participating in the in the reality in the pattern that says I'm dealing with the messiness of my life. Yeah, quite literally, it's the most embodied, like smallest form. Yeah, and then you do that, and then your your even like even even your brain chemistry, but like your whole person starts to understand how that wavelength moves yeah. and how to embody that in reality. And then you do the next thing and the next thing and the next thing. And then, and then you have a family that's coherent and then you have a community that's coherent and then you run for a governor. And like, I understand these things in a, yeah. in a primordial way because I've participated in the pattern all the way down. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That's good. Participate in the pattern. Yeah. That's, <laughs> that's the takeaway. <laughs> no, but it's, it's, uh, it's true. And I actually, I think um, in the Office of Readings, right, um, a commentary on the call of St. Matthew, there was uh, that, that uh, the Venerable Bede, oh, yeah. said, <laughs> the, the Venerable St. Bede said uh, that when Christ called Matthew, he was calling him to model his life, uh, Matthew's life after the pattern of Christ's life. Mm. You know, yeah, that, that's yeah. what it means to follow Christ, is to, yeah. to follow the pattern of Christ's life. Yeah. And so, yeah. like I said, it's not just like, an analogy to then then pick up your cross. It's no, that's the pattern of what you have to, yeah, yeah, participate in. Yeah, is, the, is what Christ did. You too must do. Yeah, yeah. As a musician, that just resonates with me. No pun, but like like <laughs> so much. Just like the idea of pattern recognition of like mu- uh, like music being played in harmony, and you know, there's the, the, there's no analogy between a guitar and a drum. Like I'm not trying to find an arbitrary connection. It's that there's a rhythm, a rhythm that I have to participate in in order for there to be a coherent song. Song, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like it's just, it just seems so obvious to me as an artist that like this is how reality works. But it, it's tough to like how to like translate that to to everyday life. Yeah. Uh, but I mean, obviously, Christ does it best. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> nice. 